think it honestly like it only takes that case of first week of a person starting a job. Um, like um, one of the best things to do is start by introducing them to all the staff. Um, also providing some form of background as to what each staff member does. So in case something happens and you don't know where to go, you at least have information in front of you. It's like okay, like this staff member does this, so maybe he's the best, he or she is the best person to approach for that. Um, and in training, like honestly, just the basics. That, like you don't have to go too in depth, but at least that you know that you can get on your own two feet and start going. Like I think that's that's very important. I'm not totally sure that unions could help the needs of youth, just because unions are for employees. And the main issue with youth is that they're not getting the jobs in the first place because they're considered underqualified or there's just perceptions of youth that employers and hiring people are concerned of youth in general. I guess the only way that unions could help is ensuring that youth get equal chances with other people in the organization for moving up the ladder or getting training and other benefits within the company. So if there's two people that are, have been working there for two years and one's 21 and one's 41, to make sure that the 21 year old has the same chances of advancement and training as someone who's 41. I think one of the many things that uh, workplaces can do is to have more opportunities for full-time employment for you. Uh, when you're locked into a temporary contract and it's only for two or three or four or six months, uh, you can't plan your future. So if a youth actually wants to stay in one location for a long time, you're kind of up in the air and you're constantly applying for different jobs in different fields. Uh, also, if you have more work training programs so that students that are going to go into that field, when they know that they're in university and they know that's something that they want to do, uh, have opportunities to gain experience in them and taking chances on youth because not every youth is going to have the same educational background and the same experience that it's going to meet the criteria, but if you take a chance on a youth and you actually want them to succeed in your company, and you put the effort into training them and you have different um, benefit packages and stuff, youth are going to actually want to stay in your company and you're going to want to be a better employee too, just like any other